So before we get into why the entire fucking idea is stupid, um, I want you to check out the merch. Draven's got the merch. Heelshitshop.com. Heelshitshop.com for all your merch needs. Uh, we've got the new logo shit on there now. I should be getting my sample. Uh, shit, I thought it was today. But I'll have to, I'll have to check. Um, <clears throat> uh, a couple of weeks up. Uh, the new Thumpism shirt. You guys will get a kick out of that. Um, mm -hmm. But all right. Back to this fucking belt. One. The, because nobody had to beat Roman for a belt. This new world champion will immediately be the B-show champion. He will be the B world champion, okay? Because cause Roman's still going to be the, the universal WWE champion. And I don't know if they're going to still have him carry two belts, but fuck it, I would. Because you're, you're just, you're setting whoever wins it up to be, it's going to be U.S. championship level as the, as that guy. And I pray to God that I hope it's not Cody. Because Cody needs to beat Reigns for the championship to complete this come up. If he goes through this fucking King of the Ring tournament and wins that shit belt, he will always be number two in that company. Always. What say you? That's a fair assessment. Um... I did think when I saw the belt, I did me immediately think, well, now they have a belt to give to Cody. But I do think that, um, I mean, in order for Cody to be number one, he does have to beat the number one person <coughs> in the company right now, and that is Roman Reigns. And whoever mm -hmm. does get that belt is going to be on the 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 lesser side of things. Um but I think it, I mean, the, Roman Reigns started off on the B show and look at him now. So, I mean, it doesn't have to be a bad thing. Yeah, but he didn't, he didn't win a quick tournament to get a world championship consolation prize. I mean, he, he went through all the programs. He had long-term feuds. He won the titles. He's defended the titles and, I just think that, I mean, I, I hope it's Seth Rollins because he's of the, the type of charisma that could potentially put this belt over. But Cody, in order to be the number one guy, he has to beat Reigns for the title. And if he doesn't, he just, I mean, they're wasting by far the biggest baby face in the country, in the company. Here's my dilemma. With that World Heavyweight Championship being debuted, quote unquote, is it going to follow in the legacy of the prior WWE World Heavyweight Champion? You know what I mean? Like, like when um, when Bischoff debuted it in 2002, it was a brand new belt. It had no significance to the WCW belt that was you know retired months before that. Nothing has come up about that just because of the shock and awe of a new belt that doesn't have a massive ass fucking logo, and that's it, even though it really kind of does. Mm -hmm. If it does follow the lineage of the World Heavyweight Championship from 2002 to, what was it, 14, the end of 14, it, it kind of already has its own like aura about it. Why not give it to somebody that you're not really expecting. My my first thought would be Gunther. It's I, I think it's time for him to move up to that next step in his career right now. Yeah. Because I, I know I know from last year <clears throat> at WrestleMania they said he wasn't ready and then just the performance from last year's WrestleMania all the way to the Royal Rumble, him now holding the longest rumble record and that that banging ass match that he had on fucking WrestleMania this year. I think he's ready to drop the IC belt 
and go for the big gold. That's who I would put it on. Now, going back to what you said about Roman, and this is just fantasy booking, if he did drop the belt at Mania to Cody, wouldn't the big gold look like a consolation prize to him, though? Because you know they'd put it on him real quick. Who? Roman? Yeah. Well, no, if he lost- he'd be on the same show as... In that scenario, he'd be on the same show, and the brand, brand split's supposed to be pretty hard this time. Uh, That's what I'm saying. If the WWE champion's on the opposite show of Roman, and Roman lost it at Mania, it's just a foregone conclusion that he's going to get put the World Heavyweight Championship on him. Why not? He's your biggest heel. He's your biggest draw. Uh, 